Hey guys, welcome to Crazy Days. Today, we're out in the cabin garden, and yes, it is looking a little green. All that rain helped a little bit, but it hurt a little bit. Danny's got a video coming out uh, one day toward the end of the week on the corn. And in that video, you're going to see a one short snippet of my corn. And I'm going to put it in this video also, showing you what my corn looked like three days ago. Okay, so I came over here today. I haven't been here in, uh, uh, since yesterday evening and yesterday it was still looking pretty bad all my corn was on the ground so you see from the picture it was just blown over it happened two days this past week um the first day we just had some real heavy wind no rain and it just blew it all one way and then the next day it had some extreme winds like straight line winds and it just kind of twisted it all so i was really worried about the corn i thought i'd lost it all but let me show you what it looks like today this is my candy corn. It was all laying over, as you could see in the clip before, it was just blown around and laying on the ground. It is twisted, it's coming up crooked, but the sun has pulled it back up. You can also see it's tossling. Okay, this is my waist right here. This corn is short. It shouldn't be that short. Uh, granted, that one is twisted or it would be taller. But you see, all of them are very short. And I'm not sure why I didn't think it was quite time for it to be tossing, but it, it is. It's trying to make, and we're going to leave it and see what happens. Also, the squash that Danny planted, most of them are looking pretty awesome. We've got blooms. We've had a couple of squash off of them. And in some of the squash down here, I think uh, the uh, vine borer's got a couple of them. But look at those peas. These peas are blooming. Little peas and blooms. These peas are not very big. They're short. And I didn't think they'd make. But these over here are taller. They're getting a bigger size to them. So at some point we should have some pink eye purple hole peas. I believe that's what I planted. I have two watermelons up here that are just now starting to grow a little. And they have blooms on them, both of them. I have tomatoes on all my tomatoes, and they're doing good. I have sunflowers standing up in the background. And some of our potatoes that we had, the little fingerlings, are starting to die. So we're going to get in here and dig these probably in the next day or so. Um, we have some squash plants, one here. This one... It's just going to town. It's going all over the place, and we have little squash starting to form on it. So we're hoping to have some squash. The basil seems to be doing wonderful. And like I said, from this angle, I've got tomatoes. These were uh, a patio tomato. Um, seem to be doing okay. The asparagus is doing good we're going to have asparagus across here I'm trying to keep it clean so it keeps multiplying and guys i'm just proud of the corn and the squash so we're going to hang in there and see if the corn and the squash make and the peas and the tomatoes and the asparagus thank you guys from crazy days